Measurement Systems for Floating Cells in Mining, researcher Miguel Maldonado. The average recovery rate of the flotation process in copper mining decreased by 3% between 2000 and 2014, reaching a recovery rate close to 86%. The loss of efficiency in the process, which will be exacerbated in the future by the characteristics of the minerals and operating conditions of the flotation process, corresponds to one of the factors that explain the gap between the tons of ore processed and the tons of refined copper produced between 2000 and 2014. A problem faced by the operators of flotation circuits to find and control more efficient operating conditions and thus maximize the metallurgical performance of the process is the lack of instrumentation to characterize both the pulp and the gas dispersion online and in real time. To respond to this challenge, a research team from the University of Santiago developed two submersible systems for online and real-time measurements. The systems measure the concentration of solids and air in mineral pulp, which is aerated through the introduction of gas in the form of bubbles. The system's resulting information allows for making timely decisions regarding the dosing of reagents and control of airflow, as well as detecting malfunctions in real time, allowing for optimization of the metallurgical performance of the flotation process. Plus, the technology does not require recalibration once installed. Currently, the technology has a patent application from the University of Santiago in Chile and is available to be tested in commercial pilot levels and then transferred to the market for commercialization and flotation plants of medium and large copper mining companies, both nationally and internationally. For more information, send us an email or visit our webpage.